I have questions. No, questions. <laughs> hi, okay, hi, Laura. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Okay. Yeah, uh, cool. yeah, What's yeah, going to happen yeah. next season with Caesar, yeah, like Caesar and Oscar? Are you... You, you love your brother. Uh, I love my brother. I uh, I have my own uh, conceptions of what I'd like to do to Latrell. I'm gonna leave it up to the writers. I trust them. You know, uh, they're in, they're incredible, and I'm and I'm. I don't know. I'm really excited to read episode one, season two, because I don't know what they're going to do. All I know is that whatever they do, it's going to be fantastic. Well, you're one of the, the, everyone has always talked about how you're always the happiest person on set, and yet you're playing this hardcore, uh, like, gang member brother who, you know, kind of yells his brother and teases his brother. Like, how, how, how hard is it for you to portray this character because of what, how your nature is naturally? Yeah, uh, I guess uh, my whole thing that attracted me to this to this role that was what they were, the way that I was written and I thought that I could really come in and, and show dignity and, and grace to a, a community that's mostly um, misinterpreted I would uh, you know uh, so for me my hardness you know uh, is uh, is just a, a social situation that I have going on and this is you know the light or the love or the Julio shines through that um, so even though Julio and Spooky seem very dissimilar they're very much the same person, just grew up in different situations. Last time we saw, like, Caesar didn't listen to his brother. He broke the rules, and now, you know, there's so, so much crap that happened during the Sinkins and Anna. How do you feel like that's going to affect next season for your character? Uh, well, not only my character, everybody. You know, I think that I think that uh, the loss of innocence uh, in general, every, you know, the, the great thing about season one is that you see these kids going through this thing and you feel free. Even though all these things are happening, you feel kind of like happy and because the kids are not ignorant but they're um, blind to a lot of the situations until this really happens I think season two they're gonna come in realizing that this is a real life and all the things that you know spooky was saying was was real you know um, it wasn't a joke it wasn't a game it was a real situation so yeah. that's so funny that you asked um, <laughs> I'm hi I'm Jessica the real star of the show on my actually, block actually uh, we just don't want him to get any love um, <laughs> Jessica when I when I when I came on set and I and I and I started talking to her she was like my simpatico Aww. like the one that I was everyone works really hard on set she yeah. works the hardest and I want to work harder than her I can't so. even joke around, and now he's so sweet to me. <laughs> now I feel bad that I bombarded you. No, but please keep going. I, I love see more events. I hope so. You I might. So. You might. Oh, it's up to the writers. Oh, oh, hey, sorry. What's up? This guy. Sorry. This guy. This guy. What are you going to do season two when I come after you? Season two? Uh, I'm going to get a stunt double to yeah. take care of all of my scenes with this guy. Because <laughs> they're going to be scary. Yeah. I don't want to die of a heart attack. How can you be scared of this face? Look at right? that smile. Okay, okay. He's in Julio mode right now. It's true. It's He's true. not in spooky mode right now. Do the yeah. eyebrow. Do the eyebrow. We can all do it, okay? <laughs> oh, the eyebrow? Ready? We can all do the eyebrow? The eyebrow? We can't Ready? do it. We can't do it. Ready? Ready? One of those. Hey. <laughs> it's, so contagious. it's contagious. It's yeah. contagious. Yeah. Well, we just just took over are we going to see any romance from any of you guys? Oh, we know okay. what you have a month. Have any uh, romance? I think I think uh, Jasmine steals Monte's. I come in between oh. brothers. Yeah. yeah. Oh, is she gonna come between you? Maybe. Yeah. Who knows? Why not? Comes in between. No, I'm kidding. I have no idea. We haven't looked at the writers' <laughs> writing yet. They just but started you, writing. But in your mind, you want this to happen. Okay, one more of course they do. Yeah. I'll speak for him. <laughs> in my yeah, in my mind, I'd I'd like for Spooky to have someone and kind of show that like <clears throat> Kaylani <laughs> Kaylani Kaylani oh. Kaylani for Netflix please yeah. uh, no the, the same way that like uh, people say oh episode 8 we saw you break not break down but break through with uh, you know the relationship with um, Lil Spooky so I thought that it'd be really cool to show that in other aspects yeah, yeah. yeah I want to see some fight scenes between me and him. I also want to see some fight like, scenes yo I'm yeah. so down to train for like a month or two but with this guy like doing MMA or you oh, know oh that'd be so awesome wow. and then really go in there and do some fight scenes that'd be cool <laughs> I'm gonna be real if Jasmine came in to fight you guys she would win though she would win yep. she would win like when she comes in I'm like oh my god that girl <laughs> and I'll be ready to go they got nothing on me <laughs> okay but I asked Diego this already but a lot of shows are becoming musicals and plays on Broadway. Okay, what do you guys think of this? On my block, the musical. Hell's yeah. Oh my Hell's it's yeah. It's got to be written by my man Lin. Yeah, Lin-Manuel. Yeah. Lin-Manuel, 100% would have to do yeah. it. 100%. Or Winnie. 
yeah. Winnie could do it too. She, she could do it. I mean, she could do it. Yeah. Uh, I'm about it. Yeah. I'll, I'll, the only thing is that we'd have to have musicians on, like, on stage. I'd love to see that. Like oh. an actual DJ yeah. spinning over, say, Brett Gray. If y'all haven't listened to Old Thing Back, Jamal. Get on it. Yeah. I can imagine the car rolling on the stage. Yeah, with the music. Oh, yeah. 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 He really... And then he calls, like, uh, Caesar, get in the car. That's a good vision. That's a good vision. <laughs> do you vision. hear this? I'm about the musical. Direct all my I'm about the musical. I, say you direct it. I have this all in my head. Already, Let's do guys. it. All my, and it's such a good name already. On my block. That's a hit. That's a, like, oh, that's that's a hit. Musical. Thank you, Lauren. That was great. Right, uh, <laughs> Thank you. We're so sorry. We like bombarded you. <laughs> no, thank you guys so much for being here. 